tonight, an El Cajon mom taking no chances after rumors of threats at her son's school. But when she called to say he would be staying home, she was told he would be marked truant. 10 News anchor Arielle Westler is live at Montgomery Middle School. Arielle, she says that the school said that her safety concerns were no excuse for the boy missing class. Well, Kimberly, that's right. There are 10 reasons that qualify, including illness, medical appointments, and court dates, but not safety concerns. Now, this morning, Montgomery Middle School emailed this letter out to parents pointing to a lack of any evidence of school threats. But one mom is not convinced and says she has that right as a parent. Kelly Green is choosing to keep her son Brayden home Friday from Montgomery Middle School. They told me that if I did, he would be marked truant. But she thinks it's the right thing to do, given rumors about possible threats. For me to actually receive an email stating that, that I take that a little bit more seriously. Never gotten a letter until now. Never. Brayden is her only son, so she admits she's a bit overprotective. As a, as, as a parent and a, and a single mom, you know, you know, that's my main concern is his safety. You don't want to take any chances. Exactly. Given the current situation, though, she thinks it should count as an excused absence. But the Cajon Valley Union School District says they're just following the state rules and he'll be marked as unexcused. It is based on uh, California Ed Code. Attendance is important and it's a, the major way we get funding in schools. The district feels strongly school is the safest place for children. We have like a one to 30 ratio. We're listening to students. We have, we work with El Cajon police. Assistant Superintendent Karen Minshew says it would take multiple unexcused absences before it becomes a truancy. But Green argues that's missing the point. I'd rather them lose money than I lose my son. And she wants the rules to change. We shouldn't be punished for keeping them at home for their safety. A green says some of her friends or some of her son's friends are also staying home from school. But in the long run, the district says that grades weigh heavier than attendance does. Either way, the district says it offers a free Saturday school once a month where students can make up an absence. We're live in El Cajon tonight. Ariel Wessler, 10 News. Ariel, thank